December the 8th, 2023. Guys, the uh, situation yesterday with Norman was very sad. It, it pretty much tore me down. And uh, I went over last night. I was going to delete the video. And uh, I said, I had my hand on the, I had my mouse hoovering over the delete button on YouTube. And something told me, don't do it. Uh, it he's been rejected by the world. I'm not going to delete his picture now. Uh, I'm going to keep that video up there. But I got this this morning, and uh, I know it's kind of been an emotional roller coaster for a lot of you guys. I, I read the comments. But this little fella here is a young husky. Uh, four, he's, he's smaller than uh, Norman was. He's a young adult male. He's in California, guys. Notice at the top. This animal could be euthanized if not adopted soon, urgent after today. I just got it this morning, so I'm sorry about that. But um, he is, let me pull this down, guys. This is his number. His ID is A530441. He says, I am described as a male black and white Siberian husky. The shelter thinks I'm about two years old. I weigh approximately 34 pounds, and I have been at the shelter since December the 1st. I may be available for adoption on December the 8th. And again, that's today. And he's at Merino Valley Animal Services, Riverside County. This is 14041 Ellsworth Street, Merino Valley, California, 92553. Telephone number is also here, 951-413-3790. Now, again, I know that it's been a lot of us were hoping and yesterday and praying for somebody to get to Norman and uh, they did they only gave him let's see he went in on the second and they uh, killed him on the sixth so what they, he didn't quite get full four full days to even get a chance but uh, I've got to get over that I said, told myself guys that I couldn't do this anymore I, I get these emails every day since bandit's been gone and it's been a year uh, this month, as a matter of fact, today is would be Bandit's second birthday, and uh, so we're having a birthday party for Booger because they were they were brothers born the same time, and of course all of our other nine animals will be around the table getting uh, birthday cupcakes and stuff like that today. But if any of you guys can help this fella out, he, he's not named here like uh, Norman was, guys. But Merino Valley Animal Services in Riverside County, here's some information. And uh, you'll need this ID number more than likely. California has a lot of euthanasians uh, over there. I've noticed it in Texas because they're such large states and have way more dogs than uh, a lot of other states. But I want to show you something. We're at a website called Rescue Me. And uh, I'm going to show you how it works a little bit. It's free. You can go there, look in your state, and see, if, especially, I noticed in the comments, a lot of you fell, uh, folks, guys and girls, yesterday said, if we were closer to Memphis, we would love to have him. And that I was getting that from all over the nation. So, again, here's one in California that needs your help. He's beautiful. He reminds me very much of our missing bandit. He's, I know it's not him. I can tell by the marking here. It's a little different. But other than that, there's not much difference in the one that uh, that we lost. So let's look at uh, Rescue Me a minute. Again, the site is rescueme.org, O-R-G. This is the Husky page, but they have every type of a dog and cat i think they've got birds and other things like that too but you can hover over any of these states we're in california you notice 212 animals there that are going to be needing help you got 86 texas 112 in florida five here in mississippi you can click here and look at their list of the dogs or cats or whatever you are looking for now i have most of these uh, states checked in my portfolio and what that does is you'll get an email every day from whichever states or state that you check uh, on here or and then you check in the application to subscribe, then uh, you'll get that on a daily basis. Now, again, some you won't, you won't see in there because they don't have a new dog. You've got a, Montana, 
South Dakota, Minnesota are showing none. But there's so many here, and this is just one site, guys. There's Like yesterday was the Memphis Animal Shelter situation. It wasn't rescueme.org. But this could be very helpful to some of you guys and girls that are looking for a lifetime companion. And now, Huskies, of course, I'm a little partial, but I also have a lab and shepherd. Both were adopted. And they all have, we take care of all 10 of these the best we can. A damn sure wouldn't let anything happen to them on purpose like what happened to Norman. So, guys, go to over here to California. You can click there, and you're going to see this. You've got Bella here, Bucky. Here's another uh, female uh, Siberian Husky, beautiful dog, Haiti. There's Arlo, Husky mix, beautiful white. Here is, I can't. Oh, there's a picture right there. This is Dakota, a, a male husky. And then here's Luna. They, I just love huskies. I'm sorry, Lewis. That probably brother and sisters. Elsa here. And as you scroll down the, on the bottom of the first page, look at the pages that California has. Is the dog that right now that could be euthanized tomorrow? Guys, please find it in your heart, like I asked you yesterday, to go there, call there. If you're in this part of of uh, California, please think about saving this animal's life. It will be a blessing in heaven. It will be a blessing on earth while you're together, but it will be a blessing in heaven for taking care of God's creatures. I know he looks down on things like that. He can't help it because they belong to him. But again, rescueme.org, go there, sign up. Click on those states in your email preferences, and though you'll get an email every morning, uh, just like I do, and that's why I'm seeing this as I got up. Um, it was a long night, to, very, to be honest with you guys, a little still a little sleepy, and you can probably tell it. But I, when I go through my emails and I saw him, I almost didn't do the video. I just said it's so painful that I, I've been putting myself through this for a year now going through these every morning but uh when it's time to try to help as many as we can and uh, that's what i'd like for you to do i'm going to put the link below to rescueme.org you can go there and check on the type of animal or, or breed of dog and the states or cats or whatever you want they ha handle it all and you can again use that map and find your location but someone Please help this puppy. We're watching it. You watch it. It's a heads up. Be safe.